I can't hit that one. Can't seem to hit it at all. There we go. Okay, so now we can use our two shot for a couple of these. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you see how many turrets are over there? Wow. Look at all that. Jesus, who's torturing who? Pick up the pace, Vic. Uh, no, that's not gonna happen because I'm conserving ammo and also <laughs> trying not to die. Uh, this is this is pretty good though. This is pretty good. We're not gonna we're not gonna be in too much trouble. Wearing power armor. It does more damage if you hit the barrel of the turret. Aha! Uh -huh. There's one. Oh. No. It's all the same damage. All right. Well, we'll go this route. Maybe. Yes. Take that turret. Oh, it's a Mark III. Can't hit me right there. Okay, so that was... That was a fun little introduction into the area. Glad that I uh, stashed some things away while we were there. Oh, we got another turret over here too. Another wall turret. Thank goodness these aren't laser turrets, right? Oh my goodness. Somebody had made mention that uh, that I should have better power armor on uh, very hard mode, which we are, uh, and survival mode. Uh, it doesn't matter if you have power armor; those laser turrets will wreck you. Wreck you. <laughs> That's just how it works. I, like I said, I I it may have been an oversight, but their damage is just outstanding, outrageous, outrageous standing. <laughs> Uh, see what near sloth. Okay, what's next? Oh, our new Vic sure knows how to dodge some bullets. Good thing that's not all we got in store for him. Of course you don't. You got traps too. Traps for days. Oh, there's so many. Oh, so many traps. Okay, so this this is the master locked door, right? <laughs> really really slow show <laughs> because oh oh nice nice these were the this is what the, was where they were building the traps or where they were storing all the materials to build them very cool all right so there's got to be more there's got to be more traps don't think i can pick this and i can't pick that oh this spot you can fall through the boards yep the boards are breakable. So how do we get up there without with without the broken boards? What the hell? I see Pat Robin go faster than this man. So how do we How do we do this? <laughs> do we just follow the path? There we go. It sure does. Sure does. But I'm I'm wondering like how how interesting this will actually be because it's just me being extremely cautious <laughs> throughout this portion of the game and possibly getting a whole bunch of idiot savants to go off um, in the process. Oh, I jumped over it. All doors lead to death. Some just a little slower than others. Okay, I think I remember. Do I remember which door it was? All doors lead to death. Some slower than others. Alright. Well, what's this one? Ah, it's the right door. How about that? Okay, so there's this one. Which is grenades. And then there was this one. Which was... A monkey. Bad monkey. <laughs> Alright. Man, this is this is a rather intimidating place. Okay, so here's the here's the irradiated area. Irradiated area. We've got somebody with ramblings. Ramblings. This is the guy that just kind of shut himself away back here. He was like, "I'm just gonna take a nap. We'll be fine." Didn't work out that way. 
All right, so we took a little bit of Radix, just in case. I, I had some squirrel on a stick. Oh, look, a dirty key. Interesting, I guess. Rusty key. Okay, so there's two keys. There's a dirty key and a rusty key. How many other keys do we find here? There's a bottle. Um... Oh, the rusty key. It was the rusty key. All right. Awesome. Someone thinks he's a real tough guy, but the gauntlet ain't through with him yet. So we're done with the first part. That was the first leg of the gauntlet. Now we got to go through it through the underground portion. So those of you who have played through Nuka World, what do you think of it so far? What do you think? Are you enjoying it? Have you enjoyed it? Have you already played it all the way through? What's what's the deal? So we can activate or deactivate the turrets. Why would we need to activate them? There's nothing important on this terminal. I just uh, realized that it was for activating, the not hell? deactivating the turrets. Um, hi. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Nobody likes this. Oh, don't even. Okay, so can we deactivate them now? There it is. There it is. Okay, so after the monkey sets them off, then you go back up to the terminal and you shut them down. And now we can just walk right through. But I'm gonna take this moment to shoot all of them. Right there, in fact. Okay. Interesting. You're gonna get what's coming to you. I know that much. So is that is that red eye that's uh, that's talking on the on the intercom thing there? Uh, he's a pretty pretty fun addition to uh, to Nuka World, I think. I would think so, anyway. What what is that noise? What is that sound? Cleverly hidden tripwire. Oh, we got some rats. Mm-hmm. Rad rats. And... Ha-ha! Ha-ha! Now, now. It's okay. Oh, I could have made him kill his friend. Oh, well. They're both dead now. Wait, was there another one in there? Jesus, no. who's torturing who? Pick up the pace, Vic! Oh. Okay. That was All right, so we got animatronic aliens here. That operate just like turrets would. What else we got here? Ah, fusion core. What's next? Another turret? Cause that's done. No more? No more. <laughs> What's in here? Oh, just a regular security gate that I can't access cause I don't have lock picking. Great. Great. Landmines. Got a couple more landmines here. Yep, there's one under the truck too. Oh. Okay. Oh, now the truck is on fire. Great. Oh, I guess we should wait, shouldn't we? Oh. Huh. Wow, I guess I'm just blind. Oh, boy. Well, that's rather enjoyable. I always like a little explosive explosion in my life. As all of you do, too, I'm sure. Oh, wait, what? 
Why is the explosion happening so far away? Why is this robot active? What is happening? Okay, they're 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 active, but they're not. That's good. <laughs> All right, so maybe it was just a chain reaction thing. I guess. I'm not I'm not exactly sure what happened. There's a couple more mines here, though. See this one. And that one. Ah. Don't forget to feed the Myrlurks. Wait, we're not su we're not supposed to feed the Myrlurks. I was specifically told that. Or was it the Yaogwai? It was the Yaogwai, wasn't it? Oh boy, Razor Claw, awesome. We're wasting a lot of ammo here. Probably not the best idea. Buddy. What? Where was? What? Why? What? What is even happening? I guess we're getting we're getting the explosions that we want. Come here. Get over here. <laughs> we're making this real exciting. Okay, we're gonna shoot for the head once. And then rack up crits with the rest of the body. How about that? Okay, there's one crit to the head. There we go. Shoot the body. Okay. And now we're going to shoot the head again. Even though it's 2%, a crit is guaranteed. I love that. I love that so much. The Razor Claw is now crippled. And it's done. <laughs> oh boy. Oh man. Hey, we might be uh, we might be breaking the mold a little bit, depending on how much five millimeter rounds I have. Oh my goodness. We got a mighty minigun. <laughs> All right. Well, let's let's uh, let's bust it out. Let's uh, see what we can do with this mighty minigun. Because we were in fact out of ammo with the rest of our guns. Hey, we're all still young, man. We're all young at heart. Don't don't get all bent out of shape just because I stopped to pick up a mighty minigun. All right? I don't I don't need your sass, red eye. You're going to be you're going to be working under me anyway. <laughs> oh boy. Or you're going to be you're going to be working for me, I guess. Uh-oh. What was that? I, I hit a tripwire and nothing happened. That concerns me. <laughs> Alright. Alright, there is there is uh, grenade bouquets. All over. All over up here. You see all these? Oh, okay. That's a little... A little unnerving. Just a little bit. Okay, that one's already been tripped. Oh! What the hell? I see faster than this man. That one got tripped already. That's the explosion he was talking about. Whoops. Someone thinks he's clever. Time for a little reality check. Let's see oh, how okay. he can kill the gas before the gas kills him. Yep, yep, there is some deadly gas in here. <laughs> Oh, that is doing a lot of damage. All right, so I, I took some jet just so we can get a, a look around and some medics to reduce the damage taken. Utility substation password. Glowing rad roach. Legendary rad roach. Take that. And that. Oh boy. Wow, okay, that's interesting. Is this, is this the one that, that explodes? Mutant Slayer's Laser Musket. Huh. Interesting. We're not going to encounter many mutants here, sadly. Um, 
Right. <laughs> you gotta take yeah. a little more than turning some valves to stop the flow of this. Gas. I know. Come on. I know. I know. Bobby pins, stim packs. Very nice. Okay, so we got got a key that was stuck in this one. Whoa! Wasting time, Vic. Just wasting time. How do we get into that room there? I wonder. Oh, we're choking up here. Oh, whoa. Okay. Wait, what? Where'd that roach go? It's just gone. It was a legendary. Oh, I wonder what what he had to do to to record that. Oh, <laughs> ew! That's the one that makes the babies. You're just kind of levitating there. Ghoul Slayer's metal chest piece reduces damage from ghouls. All right, the doors are open. That means we can just up and leave. Uh, wrong way. This is the recon log, Sergeant Marks. Interesting. All right, well, that was a that was an interesting interesting little levitating. Ah, right. Oh wow! All right. Thanks for being so supportive. I guess. What what do you say to that exactly? Um, okay, so I'm out of ammo for Kellogg's pistol, so we'll switch that out. Found a combat shotgun in the process, so we're going to use that. Um, it's a new a new enemy type, uh, a new returning enemy type. It's a flying ant swarm, and they are doing a lot of damage to me. A lot of oh my goodness. Okay. Nope, they're getting they're getting the alien blaster. They're getting alien blasted. Yes. Give me that ant meat. Was that the only one? Is that the only flying one? No, it was not. Okay. Another crit. There we go. That one that one went down a little bit faster than the last. Oh. Okay. Jumping at me like a crazy flying jumping ant. I ant having it? Haha! <laughs> uh. Hey man, I gotta be slow and methodical about this if I'm gonna survive. That's just how it is with the two timer, my friend. What what is what is going on here? Audience participation. Oh no you don't. Oh my goodness, they have a lot of health. Well, I guess we're gonna have to speed through it. Oh, there's grenades and stuff in here too. No, none of that. I the first time I came through this, I <laughs> it felt so cheap. Take that turret. You know what you did. Okay, that's that was a that was a terrifying bear for a second. But then I found out it was just a statue. Okay. Wait. Who was that? Who's that? Who are you? Operator Waster? I can totally shoot him from here. But I'm not gonna. Alright. You got me wired up yet, Gage? Yeah, boys. Finally. Now go shut off that damn alarm. All right, I'm on it. Uh, now where? Ah, there's my next victim now. <laughs> Don't look like much. Here's a quick rundown of how this works. You go stock up, make yourself presentable. Then we're gonna give these folks a show. A show where I decorate these walls here with your lovely brains. Thanks to this suit, I'm the only one that wins this fight. Period. You think that power armor will do you any good? Think again. All right. I guess, uh, I guess they're not used to being pacified because he is. He is not moving a, not moving a bit, not a bit. Another fusion core. 
I tab? Yeah, there is traps around here. Alright, well, let's let's take out that stingwing, I guess. After he doesn't see us. There we go. Done for. Oh, <laughs> flippy fly. Alright, back to the task.